And with that, we welcome you to the Home Depot SEC on CBS. Number 24, South Carolina against the third-ranked Bulldogs of Georgia. It is one of those palmetto drooping days. It'll make your trees melt out there and wilt a little bit. It's going to feel like 100 by the time we kick off here at williams Bryce Stadium. And we welcome you, everybody. 80,000 plus on hand. I'm Brad Nessler along with Gary Danielson. Partner, it's not very often in the week two we can say this game is going to shape the entire conference or at least the Eastern Division of it, but it probably will. Welcome to Columbia, South Carolina for an early season SEC East showdown. It's the Dogs versus the Gamecocks. Let's go! The Home Depot SEC on CBS. The best game from the best conference. Black and ship's kick. Debo Samuel's going to watch it sail over his head. Nine touchbacks in nine kickoffs for Blankenship, and that will quiet the crowd at least momentarily. Rico Dowdle over 100 yards a week ago in his first game of the season. Bentley ready to throw again. This one high and tipped and incomplete intended for Debo Samuel. Broken up by DeAndre Baker. They're just going to throw, throw, and throw some more. Overshot, oh man, Monty Rice, I think it hit him right in the face mask. Yeah. Second down and 10. This one oh, off the hands of Rico Dowdle and picked up by Georgia going the other way. DeAndre Baker is gone, touchdown. Yeah. 56 yards later, here's another look. The tip drill, and Baker down the sideline had a convoy. Nobody was going to get near him. You know, I thought he might have dropped the ball early, but Jawan Taylor, number 44, saw it as well, and he went over there and scooped it up for Georgia. From the 24, DeAndre Swift flanks from. He fakes it to him, looks right, comes back across the middle. He's got his man complete. Tyler Simmons and Georgia with a first down. Two tight ends, both Nada and Werner are on the left side. A dual tight end set. Here's a quick throw out. Nico Hardeman's got great speed down the sideline and a hurdle job. Got him a few extra yards into South Carolina territory. DeAndre Swift trying to get to the edge. He got there and he's going for the touchdown. 17 yards, and Georgia scores again. 11.50 remaining in the first quarter. DeAndre Swift, who had a touchdown last week, has got his second one of the season, capping a 76-yard drive in just four plays. 14-0 Bulldogs. The time lines up left, so that's the matchup they're going to get. Unless he's coming in motion, which and he is here. Gets and, right out, and he's going to get dragged down. Georgia knew exactly what we knew. DeAndre Walker, 22. Georgia going the wrong direction. DeAndre Swift takes it back the other direction for a good game. Got it out for the 23. Second and 10. Play fake. That is a lateral out to Samuel. And he's going to be dropped for a loss. Four wide out group for Bentley. And he's in trouble. Hit in the backfield. Georgia's going to get to him. Down he goes. First guy was DeAndre Walker, and then Taylor and company cleaned up. Trying to field goal. 
So it's Bentley on fourth and long. Throws tipped and intercepted. No, dropped. Georgia had his hands on another one. It was Walker who should have had the interception and couldn't hold it. Yeah. Play action. Fromm's going right back to the air, and he is going long. Going to be a jump ball out there. No, it won't be. It's going to be a flag instead. And Fenton, who had the interception on the last play, is going to have the interference on this one. Holyfield. Off the left side, Elijah Holyfield's got a big game. Inside the 35 to the 33. Blankenship's kick on the way. Just tucked it inside the left upright. It's good. So far, Rico Dotto back behind him. He pumped once and now a streak down the sideline. Almost intercepted close. again. Very close. Cox have to get to the 35 for a first down here as Bentley goes across the middle, completes it, but it's not a first down, and down goes one of our officials <laughs> on a day this warm. Brian Harrigan on the carry. He got a nice game, picked up about four. From going to flare it out. DeAndre Swift got. The first down somehow. Yes. He caught it at the line of scrimmage, was almost knocked out of bounds, and somehow slipped away. Yeah. Dowdle behind Bentley will get the handle. Man, he got undercut in a hurry. Nice hit by Natrez Patrick picking for the Georgia 26. Bentley got a loft one for Dowdle. Incomplete, and LeCount got his hands on it again. And they're going to bring five at least. Georgia brings five. Bentley running out of time. He's going to go down. DeAndre Walker gets to him. Yeah, they pinch. A little bit of pressure now on Jake Fromm. Didn't look that good in the last series. He got away with one to Hardman. And he's going to be close to a first down. Oh, I have it. That field with Fromm. Now Swift will go in motion out of it. Fromm fires complete. Terry Godwin give him ground to gain ground. And he's got to pick up a 12 of the first down. Second down and four. Holyfield cuts it to the corner. He's got the first down, and the stiff arm takes him out of bounds with the first down. Camarda, the punter, will kick it away near his own. Near the 50, I should say. And over end job this time. He keeps it in the field of play. Fair catch taken around the eight-yard line. Bentley. This one's tipped again at the line of scrimmage. That's the danger. Yep. Became more important if they got blocked to raise those hands. Bentley, here comes Heat again from the backside. The throw is caught. And short of the first down, but a nice catch by Debo Sandy. Sure and that's an empty backfield. Jake Fromm from the 33. Throw is complete to not at a tight end who might have a first down. It was very close. I'm trying to get a late drive here for some. Points before halftime. Fromm fires near side. Got it complete. Ridley again. Riley got the first down. Diving through the would be tackle of J.C. Horn. He showed it all last year. Fromm again. Flushed out of the pocket. He's going to head to the sideline, get what he can, and get out of bounds. Kick out of the way. Perfect. Cool. That was good from 60. DeAndre Swift trying to get to the edge. He got there. No problem getting warmed up today in Columbia, South Carolina. Just about set to start the third quarter. Not going deep and stretching the field at all vertical. Georgia on the ground. DeAndre Swift. Swift's got a first down on the first carry of the third quarter. Good for about 13. Elijah Holyfield with Fromm now in the Georgia backfield. Fromm throws complete. Riley Ridley again and another first down. Holyfield powers his way up the middle close to another first down behind Cade Mays the freshman number 77 helped him up. Sure did. Georgia going a little tempo here. Same now they go again. right back the Same. other way. And again it's Hardman down the sideline. Broke yeah. free and he's gone. Touchdown. Steven Montag thought he had him.
Rico had yeah. different ideas. 34 yards and a touchdown. He misjudged Hardman's speed. Got the good block by Tyler Simmons, number 87. We've been talking about that. And then kind of rounded off. He has to come across, anticipate taking away the big play. Comes up, and then he rounds it. He's beat. Hardman's too fast for him. Misjudges the speed and it's a touchdown. It's not good news for that guy, but he has to produce some points here. Again, a tip ball. <laughs> and it was Tyler Clark when you the bottom of your screen right now. Third down of two. Bentley again down the middle, but broken up in and out of the hands of the intended receiver. Good player, and he's going to play. Yep. From throws the out again, complete broken tackle. Jeremiah Holloman. Holloman bangs off his own guy, and he's got a first down, and he's still standing. You know, I would not call it a controversy. Elijah Holyfield flanks Jake Fromm. He wants to throw again deep on the sideline. This time he's got Hartman again. Almost took it the distance again. I mean, one there to cover the play. Now they go to the ground. Elijah Holyfield a stiff arm heading to the end zone. Touchdown, Georgia. Elijah Holyfield, as he did a week ago with a touchdown romp. And Georgia now stretches it to 33 to 10 with the extra point coming up. 13 out of the end zone. Eliza Holyfield heading in for the score. And now Kirby Smart says, I like how this is going. 34 10. Battle stood up just before he can get to the first down marker by Taylor again. Rushing in this football game right here, it's hard to imagine that you can throw the ball enough with no balance and beat this Georgia defense. Wow, and Georgia just was not going to let. We got our playmakers back, and it looks like this. And the problem is, as Hardman, who's made the big plays for Georgia, gets another first down. The problem, Blankenship right before the break and haven't slowed down since. And Brian Herrien blasts his way out close to another first down. Ten man difference is how you build a squad. There's a run blitz by South Carolina. It really doesn't pay off for him as Herrien just keeps dragging guys and still out to close to another first down. Boy, just kept the wheels churning, didn't he? Elijah got the edge. He's off to the races. Holyfield down the sideline. Another Georgia first down. Well, they're just in time. Heavyweight champion of the world. DeAndre Swift back in there. And he goes for the first down run. In a tailback. They just keep rotating those three guys at the tailback spot. And it's Harry and straight up the middle and in the end zone. Touchdown, Georgia. 19 yards straight up the gut. Well, if you had any questions about how good are the dogs, yeah. the number serving, three team in the country. Serving notice, aren't they? I think so. Pass, pass, and pass some more now for Bentley. This one to Donald, and he just got stood up and stoned right there before he could get to the first down mark before the end of the third quarter. Just did. Bentley, the pump fake now comes back to his safety valve, and he's dropped immediately. Be there. Drew Locke's pretty good. Yep. Bentley, quarterback, draw. And not going to get there. Too many athletes on this defense. Yep. Fourth and three. Bentley fires a slant and nope. incomplete. Yep. Did J.R. Reed intercept it? I don't or did he just think break it so. Up? I think he just broke it up. Did he catch it? I thought it hit the ground. Let's see. He yeah, he did. It. He got it. I thought he, he ran out. I thought he just knocked it down. But yes, anticipated the play. From up here at our angle, I couldn't tell. On TV, it might have been a lot more easy to see, but it's a yes, beautiful play. Surely. And the Plains, the Jordan Hare, and they take on Auburn in the Battle of Tigers. Here's the freshman, James Cook, who didn't play in the first half because of a targeting foul a week ago. In the SEC. Fields throws on the run. Nice pass, complete out to Trey Blunt. Into the pros. Cook. That last little bit of effort yeah. got him the first down. Boy, he's before getting hurt last year, so a medical red shirt and then the transfer. He's from basically south of uh, yeah. south of Savannah. One of the biggest changes in what do you do? I mean, every coach's coach has had to go through this. Right. Hudson, nice run. First down. 
That'll take the clock down. We'll probably have uh, another play. Team win. Fields takes a knee. And that should just about do it. Kirby Smart going over to meet his old friend. They've even vacationed together a lot in the past. He said it used to be easier. We were both assistants. It's hard to go against a good friend. And today he had the better team by quite a bit. 41 to 17, third ranked Georgia goes to 2 and 0. And number 24, South Carolina, probably will drop out of the top 25 after they just got in this week. SEC East belongs to Georgia for at least the first two weeks of the season. We'll be back to wrap it up from Columbia in a minute. But Georgia put those to rest early. And they win it on the road in a big way, 41 to 17, as the dogs quiet the crowd at Williams Bryce Stadium. For Gary Danielson and Jamie Erdahl, I'm Brad Nestler saying so long from Columbia. Final score, dogs 41, Gamecocks 17. A happy Georgia team will head back to Athens with a 2-0 record and a number three ranking very secure. College football postgame show is up next after these messages. So long from Columbia.